what are our responsibilities towards nature, they're to avoid plunder. Now, avoiding plunder means two things. One is, it means that the few should not steal from the many. Natural assets belong to everybody. And the other thing, which is the big in insight of environmentalism, is that the present generation shouldn't expropriate what rightly belongs to the future. But the fundamentalist wing of the environmentalists, having got that insight about protecting the rights of the future, they get that right, but then they misinterpret it. And they think of us as, as curators of a set of natural artifacts, putting nature in a museum and preserving it for, for the future. And that's, that's not our responsibilities towards nature. If, if, if you define our responsibilities as preservation at all costs, that's fundamentally incompatible with the, the drive against global poverty. And so our responsibilities to the future are to preserve the value of, natu of nature. Nature's valuable sometimes, especially in low-income countries, the value of nature can be converted into much more productive value. Oil can be turned into schools and ports and roads that mean that the future generations are lifted out of poverty. So that we pass on value to the future, we're custodians of the value of natural assets, not curators of a set of natural artifacts. We're not museum keepers. We're building a more prosperous world.